Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another episode of Draw With Me, the show where we draw together, paint together, make beautiful craft and art. Today we're going to attempt to draw a house right from your very imagination, from the landscape of dreams and hopes and endless inspiration. Now, the tools you are going to need for this little artistic journey of yours are going to vary from person to person, I'm going to be honest with you. But generally speaking, we could say that you need a 450 gram paper some ink pens, maybe a brush or two, maybe a donut in case you get hungry and you want to eat something in between, coffee to keep you awake, because I have been told that I've got a very soothing, very soothing voice. And people sometimes fall asleep when they listen to me, so I just want to make sure that you're prepared. Now, one of the things that people struggle with, art and life in general is, they don't know where to begin. But this is actually rather easy. It's, you begin at the beginning and you end at the end, right? It's just one flow, you tap into that flow, and it just comes and goes. If we were to start drawing a house, we would also have to ask ourselves what kind of ink pen do I need to use, want to use, what kind of image do I have in my head? And the answer is something only you know. So let's begin. So before we start, we just gonna use this little fairy brush that's shaped like a mermaid and as you see I clean the canvas a little bit and yeah maybe it's just me but I think it's good practice to keep the paper clean and you can get these little fairy brushes that are really soft and nice and soothe soothing like my voice you can get them at any local supermarket really and if you need multiple ones, just, you know, just get a dozen or something. By the way, in case you wonder, the quality here is a bit off, I guess. It's just my smartphone, you know. It's not the professional studio camera that the producers used. So, apologies for the diminished quality. Now, as you can see with your little sparkling eyes, this is a little staircase in, you guessed it, a forest. You know, this is a stone and pebbles, some scratches, dust, and you know, just showing how nature does its work. While I'm putting down these lines on the paper, or the canvas, whatever you want to call it, it's up to you. I'm just thinking about the house that I want to draw. And here I'm shading a little bit, adding a few details here and there, making it a bit more vivid. I think that's the right word. As you can see, this is kind of reaching into the distance, somewhat very relaxed. And then these trees bow in all kinds of directions, like life does, you know. And it's just all going with the flow, basically. Just making a few little lines here and there, 
a few scratches, a few erases, and you know, just erasing a little bit here and there, adding a little bit of color in your imagination, and just going with the flow, really, you know. That's what all of this is about in the end, am I right? This is another attempt at a stone, a little stony theme. Maybe some leaves next to it, some bushes. But it's all gonna change, you know. It's all like art is generally up for change. It's never static, it's never just one thing, it's like everything and nothing, you know what I mean? Yeah, adding another few lines. And a big surprise, there's a sign at the corner, at the edge of the staircase, you know. It's all up to you. You, know, you don't have to follow these instructions. It's just whatever feels right to you. hesitancy when putting down the lines on paper. Maybe if you feel that the line weight is not accurate or something, you can just, you know, do it all over again. Just take the paper, throw it away, burn it, you know, pour coffee over it and make some fancy little modern artwork, you know, whatever, whatever suits your spirit. there, as you can see. Again, it's all just about the flow.
And there you go. That's your house. And all we used was this brush and a piece of paper. Now have a good one and maybe we'll meet again in this or another lifetime.